Welcome to this look at a new mod map on Farming Simulator 22 with me, Mr. Sealy P. So this is Small Cow Farm. This is a new mod map out from ABT Frankie White. It's 29 megabytes download, that's all. You may recognise it, or you will do as we go around, from Small Farm, because this is an amalgamation of Small Farm and Cow Farm, hence Small Cow Farm. It has the the tiny nature of small farm with the slightly bonkers bit of, of cow farm which is brilliant um and it's actually this has got quite a lot of scope for the way it says small cow farm it, 1200 cows the, the pen holds that's not that small to be fair so what does the map look like well it looks like this um if we zoom out you'll get some idea of the kind of normal <laughs> so it's small Field prices aren't very expensive, as you would expect. Um, this is what we start with on New Farmer. I'm on Normal Economy. Um, you start with this plot here, field 23, 13, 14. Field prices are, you know, 27 grand, 28 grand, 22. We don't actually own this plot, which is the cow pen, or this plot here, which has got some chickens and horses on, but you can still access it, which is absolutely fine. Now, this pen as well, you can't get into. It's um, it's it's kind of well, it's locked out. There are contracts available. They don't pay out a huge amount because the field's quite small. Um, but if we just look out there, the, the, the size of the field, and it's got uh, this wooden fence round. There's not a gate because I thought, oh, it's brilliant. Look at all the mowing you could do, the grass work. But I couldn't find a way into it. Plus, it wouldn't let me if we're going to build mode. Um, these fence panels can't be removed. That being said. Every other fence panel and every other bit, everything here, can be. So the hedges, the fences, the buildings, the silo stays where it is, and this large building here. But all these fences, and if you look at the all these fenced-in fields here, all these fences can be removed. I'll show you a clip of that in just a moment. Um, so, we start here. We've got a sleep trigger. We've got a 5,000 litre diesel um barrel container which is empty but you can fill it we've got a jet wash we've got a 60,000 litre solid fertilizer container the only problem with this is because this is quite close every time you come to here it turns on that so you have to kind of come up a little bit and it and you can get it to I still not doing it yeah the, that's too close to here unfortunately I did get it to work when I was doing the kind of my have a quick look round. But anyway, yeah, that's a bit tricky. You can put it in yourself, but I suppose you could delete that, move it and put it somewhere else if you wanted to. Might as well. Um, and then over here we've got a seed um, silo. 27,300 litre one. Which is also empty, as is that. But we can fill them both up if we want to. Our start equipment, or well, some of the start equipment, is just here. The slot count on all three game modes. New farmer, farm manager, start from scratch is 636. You start with all the same stuff. Um, on the on farm management start from scratch you don't you don't own the fields or the plots of land but you can buy them like I said they're not that expensive anyway uh, if we go into our vehicles and machinery you'll see we start with two small tractors a class A and 660 and the Veltra G135 we have got a Deutzfahr top liner harvester small trailer we've got header disc harrow power harrow subsoiler Cedar, mower, and then we've got a load of grass equipment. So tether, windrower, baler, and some front loader gear, and a header trailer. Um, the reset point on the map it doesn't really matter. The workshops, uh, the main vehicle store is just there, and this is yard. So it doesn't really matter where it's going to be. You know, I was going to check, but like I say, it doesn't matter. Uh, if we head down here, the only sell point we've got on the map at the moment, and again, you can place anything you want. The same with any map, really. It's the farm shop, which is just there, and then there's a secondary point, which is just around the back there. One is for your grain-type stuff, and one is for your pallet -y type things. Um, as we move around, we've got the vehicle, um, the workshop trigger, just there. Then we've got our vehicle store trigger, just there. And then we've got our livestock market trigger, just there. And if we come just out of here, we've got a debris crusher. So it's far and it's header and header trailer. Farmer 400 silo, 400,000 litre. Our trailer's just there. Our mowing equipment and another little shelter with the Veltra, the baler and stuff like that. We've got a chicken pen which holds 30 chickens. And we've got a horse pen which holds five horses. Like I said, 
I don't, don't have a look. I've, I've kind of been all the way along. I thought maybe there's a gate that end, but there's not. Um, and then you've got your small fields further down. There's no biogas plant on here. There's no forestry, but you could, you know, you can plant, you could make a forest. You know, I was looking at the map when I kind of came on and I thought, you know, there is a strip down the side there. If you wanted to, you could, hang on, there we go. You could plant trees all up there if you wanted to, or, you know, you could pick a couple of these plots before you start your Let's Play, plant a load of trees and then grow them and then start your Let's Play if you wanted to do some forestry on here. Um, what I'm going to do now is just whiz back to the um, Sleep Trigger and I'll show you just a short video clip I, I made. Normally I just do a screenshot saying this is what it will look like. Um, I got the slot count down to 484 by selling all the buildings, selling all the vehicles, and I got rid of all the fences, the hedges, gates, everything that you could get rid of. Um, so I'll just jump to that short video clip now just to give you an idea of the expanse, the area you can have, the fields you could maybe combine together, or the fact you can then, if you want to, you can place whatever you want on here. You can go full start from scratch and kind of, you know, however you want to go about it. So there you go. That's what that all looks like. So what we'll do now is from here. It's, the, the thing is, when I came on and did the map tour in here on Small Farm, yes, it has changed. Definitely, all this you know, all the stuff around here has changed because there was a cow barn, cow shed down there, and so it has changed. It's still very picturesque. It's lovely little, you know, tiny little map to be getting on with. And we come up here, and this is where the bonkers part of cow farm takes hold. We've got a water point just here. Um, for getting water, how water trough just here, feed just there, and then here. Hang on, I think the trigger's just behind it. There we go. 1,200 cows the pen will hold. What I'm going to do is just buy one. Um, just to put one in there. So I can go and check the pen there. Because what I wanted to look at was over to the side productivity, water, milk. Right. So this is like a normal, um, like a grazing pen. There's nowhere to put um, straw in. It's not asking for straw. So, um, and there's nothing there that says slurry. So you're not going to get um, manure and you're not going to get slurry from this. You are just going to get milk. It's purely a, an open pass if you're doing that. But again, if you clear some of those areas out or fill to that to the side, you could then have a standard cow pen and you could rotate your cows in and out of it if you want then to have manure or slurry and stuff like that, you could do that if you wanted to. Um, and that's the map. That small cow farm. They weren't joking when they said it's small, um, but then a little bit mad with the uh, capacity of the cow farm. Um, I, I, normally I would show you the where we've been on the map, but you know, we've just been here really, and then up to there. That was it. Small cow farm by ABT Frankie Y. Hope you find this useful and informative in some way shape or form if you have please give us a like if you haven't subscribed yet please do if you want to leave a comment feel free and if you want to share this video then please be my guest whatever you should choose to do thanks for watching